Breaking news, people. DCP Fitzbailey says the trigger man in the Trelawney Church murder has now been arrested. He surrendered to the police in the company of his attorney a short while ago. Earlier, the Jamaica Constabulary Forces Commissioner, Major General Anthony Anderson, held a press conference and basically he describes what happened yesterday was very shocking that a woman would be murdered in church. The commissioner says the fourth person will be arrested soon. As you heard me just say, the trigger man is now in custody, so he was arrested and the case is almost solved. He cites three recent cases where murder were committed in pursuit of victims' properties. He is urging potential perpetrators that they will be caught. My warning is that we don't do this, Anderson says. That's some good news, people. So, you know, I tell people, you know, you see, people will look on it and say, oh, that case gets solved so quick. It got solved so quick because of where it happened. And one of the things I realized with this government, when the government see the excitement and the government see that it is out there for everybody to see, this was a major case yesterday. We're still going to wait, you know, to see the end result and everything that comes out of it. But this was a major, major case. And there is no way they could have turned a blind eye to this, even if they wanted to. You saw a quick Horace Chang reach down there. You see how quick... The DCP come out and you see how quick the ACP come out. Now, mind you, Trelawney is known for solving cases quickly. If you recall the sister who killed her sister recently, it was in that parish. And they are known for solving cases quickly. So I am delighted that they have found the trigger man. And more than likely, you're going to hear more come out of the case to say yes. And I really, really took on this one because i don't normally get caught up into this whole crime scene and this whole killing and stuff because sometimes it inundates your mind and it's so freaking much it's like it will drive you nuts and it will drive you insane so sometimes i try and stay away from it but when i saw yesterday that this happened in the house of god now mind you some people be like oh diva oh yeah believe in that. don't worry you don't believe in god I'm not forcing you to believe in, in God, right? You don't believe in God. I'm not forcing you to believe in God. And even if you want to can't say, oh, this and that don't believe in God. Every man have a right to decide his own destiny. That is all I will tell you. You know, just know, say, God's a diva, believe in God. God. That's what the blessed D stands for in my name because I am a blessed one. I am a blessing and I am a blessed child. And I understand this totally and completely. So I'm going to ramp around with God. I'm going to play with God. I am delighted to hear that he turned himself in. More than likely, you will either start seeing pictures of the person, you will start hearing more as to what was the cause of him doing it. But you see how quick him run go in because him no one gets slapped away because him no more than likely if him don't turn himself in. I that I got me to him. But all I can say is it is good to know. Yesterday, the country was in a siege. Yesterday, the country was in mourning. Yesterday, the country was under duress because the country really never saw something so devastating. It's the first time in a long time I've seen one particular case, one particular incident, one particular murder that took an entire nation to the knees of understanding and crying out that this cannot be tolerated on this island at all. Now to the people who are talking and saying that the voice notes prove that she's wicked and stuff, I was not there. I don't know the conversations that she had with this boy. I don't know the converse. And when I buy boy, I mean the stepson. I don't know the conversations that were had. I don't know the reasoning behind it, but I still maintain I'm going to say it again and I'm going to not stop saying, you know, kill people for property, you know, kill people for vanity. I am sorry. You're just, it's just something you don't do. And people will be like, oh, you're biased because she has nothing to do with a woman. At the end of the day, she's gone. She can't tell her side of the story. How you know so she wasn't having problem with this person? How you know the husband of the son wasn't having problem with him? And people will argue and say, even if them don't have problem with him, they are no right for take the people them house. Let me tell you something. I heard all the voice notes. I had the voice notes sent to me. I had them in my possession. But one thing I will never ever do is dishonor the dead by playing stuff like that. Because no matter what a person do, even if... A person in the right, forget it as some people would have said. 
that's on a debt and something where you're going reveling. If you do what you do, you go one side and go all the corner and all the meds about what you do. But as I said yesterday, that case had a big thing for me because you can't go in a Father God church, go go on like say you're big, bad, and bold, and you want to take down people in front. From your dishonor the house of God, you must get caught. And for them, all of them would have talked about the Holy Spirit in the church, God in the church, and all of that. You don't notice what happened in the church? All know who knows the big thing what happened at the church. How many times you've ever heard of a gunman go up on a scene and leave prime evidence like his cell phone? Because the man leaving his cell phone is telling that him even know so where him do wrong. Him know where him do wrong. Him know where him do wrong. But at the end of the day, maybe him caught in a two minds. Not maybe, he's obviously caught in two minds. Because for one, if you leave your phone anyway, all today in your house. You're either distracted or you forget it. And how you going to forget it? Something like that. For one, if you may depend on him phone in a church and I use it, he wouldn't get distracted. So I'm obviously nervous. He must sweat. He must wonder. He must think. He must ponder about all the way he have to do. And me can tell you the facts. I'm left him phone in there. So enough man to laugh off him now. I idiot that's a novice, a coward, a punk. Not necessarily coward, punk, or novice. It's just that the man knows him in the house of God and him shouldn't even think about something like that. The fact that it is a contract killing tells, speaks volumes to the fact that him knows that him not supposed to even participate in them something there. But at the end of the day, them want the quick money, them have to do what they're supposed to do, and him just say, yo, he might eat a food and him have to do what he do. You know, hear them say, we know the, 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 the video, the popular video with it out there about smoke and drink and collect and all of them something there. And them think that them deal with because sometimes they mentally can't deal with what them do so them self-medicate. And the fact that him leaving phone at the church is a telling sign that listen to me. This young man did nervous. This young man did go with a clean meds in terms of what him need to do. And if someone listen to the video, good again, or not go hear the phone and go off in the video. Anyway, them catch the person. I'm just delighted. Say them catch the person. Let's hear what come out of it now. And I am delighted because, as I said, for any reason why them committed, I got to tell you now again what I argue. You don't know the full story. We are here one side of the story. We are here the other side of the story. Because they are alive and they can talk. And to even hear somebody come out and say, Yo, she am a friend. You yeah, say, Yeah, she did for dead. And, yeah, and I did your good friend. But I tell you something, man. No who I call friend too. Because me don't want them the friendship there. Anyway, tell me your thoughts now down below in the comment section. We'll have a discussion about it.